Hello my tech geeks and tech friends on YouTube, Brad to you from Tech Photomies Media, and today I'm here to bring you the full in-depth review of the Perix AX3000. Is the 7.1 Toronto gaming set worth your $30 on Amazon? Let's just start with the Starting off with the design of these headphones, they pretty much resemble a lot of the Perix AX1200s. They come with some of the same materials and some of the same phases, although there is a little more of a cushioned cotton top on the neckband which allows for more comfortable use. Inside again there are foam cushion cups as they are all Perix headphones that I've tested out which I do find to be very comfortable but after a while I do find that they do end up to have my ears hurting after a while of use of video editing or gaming. Looking down the cable you'll find a remote which allows you to increase or decrease the volume on your MacBook or even any type of other PC that you have such as Windows 8.1 or a laptop as well as a mute button for the microphone that's built into this headset. Now transitioning over to the microphone quality, I didn't find it to be the best but it was decent. For the $30 price point it definitely is worth it, it's not anything that's going to blow out of your mind but it is very decent. So let me tell you now how I thought the audio quality was. Now I did use these to edit a couple videos as well as talk to a couple friends on Hangouts and I must say there are a lot of improvements from the Parents X1200 to Parents X2000. So basically, the lows were excellent, the mids were excellent, as well as the highs were excellent. I didn't find any problems with them, but I noticed with previous Parix headphones, they had a very kind of staticky push to them whenever I turn up the volume up to 100%, but these do not distort. They sound very good and very clear whenever blasted at 100%, and it doesn't make you want to go to the hospital after listening for a long time. Another thing that I like about this pair of headphones is that it is a USB 7.1 per ounce uh, gaming headset. That means that you can only play these on computers, which is a bummer down because I really wanted to listen to music. But I did find it coming very compatible with my Mac and my Windows PC whenever editing because I did get to use a lot of the features. So basically, you plug it into a USB port and the sides of the headphones where the logo is lights up, which very looks very nice. And I do think that it's a good improvement over the past headphones with just a regular branding. I think. This is a new fortunate thing for Parix and is a really good design. Overall, I could definitely recommend these headphones. For the $30 price point, they're definitely worth it. You should definitely go check them out. So please go check the link out in the description if you are interested in buying this. And thank you so much for Parix for sending this out for reviewing purposes. Anyways, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Please like if you like the video or drop me a comment down below telling me why you didn't like the video. And I will talk to you guys next time. I'm wrapping up the video. Bye, y'all.